Krye Bashkjaku i Rochester Hills, Brian Barnett, po qëndron në një vizit e zyrtare në komunën e Tuzit. Rochester Hills dhe trejit është një vënd të kujeton një numëri madhi i diasporës son në shtetet e bashkuat e Amerikës. Barnett është një miki i dëshmuari i komuniteti shqiptar, ku në vitin e 2007-u bë dhe binegzimi mes dy komunëve, ndërsa vizitet e ti në Melsi, por realizot në ditën në më të rëndësishme për kombin shqiptar, ditën e flamurit edhe të pavarësisë Shqipëris. Zoti Barnett të mbëritim bramë në aeroportin e Podgoricës, ku prit nga në nënkryetari i komunës të Tuzit, Zoti Haris Ramovic, së banshku me dritorin e Shëpëk Komunale Nikol Samaj, shefin e Policisë Komunale Recep Qunmullaj dhe shefin e Kabinetit të Kryetarit e Drita Rukaj. Gja dite se partë të vizitës e tia ju pritë në komunën e Tuzit nga drejtuasit e këti institucioni. Në basë e pritje së lemnë në ndëtesën e komunës të tuzit, Zoti Banet vizitoj shërbimet e ujësilësit dhe kanalizimit komunales, qëndres kulturi informative e mëllësia dhe organizantës urisike, dërsa në para qytetarve të mëllësise du të ketë fjallin e rastit të gjatë manifestimit në qëndren kulturi informative e mëllësia organizuar nga komunë të tuzit me rastin e 28 në të orit. Dear Mayor Barnet, we are extremely happy that we have the opportunity to welcome you in the premise of the municipality of Tuzi, the municipality with which you have become sister city in 2007. Since that time, the municipality of Tuzi has experienced some changes, both in the way it is organized and in the economic development. At the very beginning, I invite the president of the municipal assembly, the chairman, to say some welcome words. I nderuari major i Rochester Hillsit, Zoti Barnet, të nderuar Zoti Njën Kryetari Komunës, Zoti Ramovic, të nderuar ullhejs të institucioneve dhe ndërmarje publike, dhe me ljusë të cilë është komuna jonë, pjestar stafit komunës të tuzit dhe të praniqëm të tjerë. Kam derin dhe privilegjin dhe knajsin që ti drejtëm këti të ubimi, që lidhët pikrisht me ditë në e flamurit tonë komptari 28 në nëntorin, që edhe me ligjin e shtetit e malezi u njësi fest e jona komptari privilegji është i posaqem nga se në mesin tonë, sot për shëndes kërë bashkjakun majorin e qytetit të shqetër hils me të cilin tuzi është binjaksizuar për mes e një dekade. Inderori zotëri Barnet, në mërët komunës të tuzit, ju dëshëroj mirë se ardhje në shtëpin të uaj. Ne shqiptarë në përgjithsi e malësorë në veçanërisht e kemi një thënje se shtëpije është e zotit dhe e mikut anda ju e një shtëpin të uaj dhe kështu dëshërojmë të ndjeni vetën. Komuna e tuzit në tërë komunat me të rejat malëtizi e fituar pas mes e dy dekadash angazhim të pa epur të të gjithë faktore politik dhe shëqëror shqiptar nga kjo të rejvë. Dëshira johën për të fituar komune e pavarur ishte dëshirë që të marim për gjësin për shvillimin e të rejvës e malësis në duart tona. Se kjo ishte do mëzdoshme të regojnë dhe ndryshimet për të mirë që ka përjetuar komuna tri vjetet e fundit që kur është në menagjimin tonë. Me në fund, mund të themi 
se sot jemi zot shtëpi e në shtëpi në tonë. Ndryshimet për të mirë që po i përjetojnë sot komunatuzit në gjdo fush të vërpintaris ishin të pa konceptuashme vetëm disa vjetë me përpara, kur edhe për kunder analizave dhe fakteve të shumëta, provonin të nabindin se kjo komun nuk ka resurse për që ndryshmerin ekonomike dhe të gjithë farshme duke në përcaktuar edhe planin financiar si lemosh e kërë qytetit. Sot diqë mes e tri vjetë me shumë pasi e morën përgjësin për menagjimin e vetë vetës, pra komunë e sonë, bugjetin e kemë rritur për 400% dhe po realizojmë atë pa problemë. Ekipet tona, eksperte, pa varsisht mungesës e përvojës, janë bërë shembul jo vetëm për komunë tjera, por dhe për me zjerë. Kretë kjo falë për caktimit dhe angazhimit tonë, për respektimin e liqëmëris si u dhërëfim për bëndjën e bazave të mira për një armëri me të ndryqme. Ekonomia, infrastruktura, por dhe kultura e sporti janë bërë shembul se si duhet u dhesur një trev deri dje e lenë pasdore. Punet në infrastrukturë janë gjë për diqme, e jësi me parë vetëm një së dy muaj para gjelive. Sënt mund të flasim për përmirësime të mëdha në këtë fush, ndonë se fakte të regojnë vetë. Duhet të kësuar me plot gojen se këto suksese do të ishin shumë me të vogla pa përkrahin e pa kur syrë të diaspore sonë, parë se gjithash në shtetët dhe bashkuar të Amerikës, falve printarisës dhe cilës sot në burëmi me binë një akizimin tonë me rëqës të rëhilsin dhe me një mardhenje që shkon për te i vi zitave të kurtu azijës të dy kryetarve, inderuar i zotri Barnet, falenderit për vizitën tuaj të sotme, falenderit për ndimën tuaj të pa kursuar dhe të shirojmë që këto dit të kaloni sa me mirë në komunën tonë. Falenderit. Mr. Chairman, Mr. Vice Chair, thank you so much for the invitation to be here today. Uh, it is a tremendous privilege uh, to be here, not just in our sister city and with so many friends, but on such an important day for you, on Independence Day, on Flag Day. Um, when my schedule began to become clear uh, that I would have the opportunity to spend a couple days and I looked at what was happening here, there was no place I would rather be than to come back after 13 years to visit my friends again. So thank you for always opening uh, your hearts and your homes to me, as has already been the case. Let me bring you greetings from the United States of America <clears throat> and from your friends in Rochester Hills. Uh, we share with equal pride the relationship that we have with all of you. Uh, we are a strong community in Michigan in large measure because of the wonderful Albanians that call Rochester Hills home. They are our school teachers, our business owners, our bankers, our lawyers, our restaurant owners. They are wonderfully generous people who continually contribute to the vibrancy of my community. And that's why I'm so grateful to come here and meet with all of you, their relatives, uh, to thank you for the friendship over the years. When I became mayor in 2007, I had zero Albanian friends. Now I have hundreds, and some of my closest friends are Albanians. Our city is grateful for the relationship we've had over the years and whether it's been welcoming guests from here in, in Tuzi or from other parts of, uh, of Albania, whether it's been hosting presidents as we've hosted the last four Albanian presidents in my community, whether it's raising money in the Two for Tuzi campaign we did a, a decade ago, whether it's providing a scholarship or whether it's just delivering a garbage truck. I hope you know that you can count on your friends in Rochester Hills to always support you. We are proud of the advancements that you've made as a community. And while I don't pretend to understand all of the political intricacies of full municipality, I can tell you that whenever a people experience freedom and autonomy, it is something truly to be savored. 
It doesn't mean that your problems end and that there won't still be tough conversations and challenging arguments. But when you get to make your own decisions, it just feels right. So I'm excited to join you for a few days. We have a, a wonderful celebration happening in my community later on today, I believe at 5 p.m. here, where I will Zoom and over 200 Americans and Albanians will gather in my city hall. And we're going to raise the Albanian flag for the first time in our city's history in honor, <laughs> in honor of, uh, of Flag Day and Independence Day. So to all of you, I say thank you again for showing me such warmth and hospitality. You have the full support of myself and my colleagues back in the United States of America. And I look forward to the next several days celebrating with all of you this continued friendship and partnership. God bless. Thank you, Mayor. So the people who welcomed you today are the people who lead the bodies of this institution. And I would like to start with the assembly as a representative body of citizens. The assembly was void by the president of the assembly, Mr. Fadil Kayoshai. It consists of councillors selected by citizens for a period of four years, and the municipal assembly has uh, 32 councillors. The assembly has a secretary of the assembly, Mr. Nermin Alibashic. He organizes and takes care of professional, administrative, and other tasks for the assembly and its working bodies preparation of the sessions of the assembly. The secretary of the, of the assembly manages the work with all the rights and obligations of a head of the body. The president of the municipality is the ex executive body of the municipality of Tuzi, which is represented by the president, Nick Jeljoshai. Municipality of Tuzi has two vice presidents, Mr. Haris Ramovic and Ivan Ivanay. Administrative bodies are established as secretaries. The secretariats are the Secretariat of Local Self-Government, which is managed by Marina Wikai, where administrative tasks related to monitoring and implementation of laws and other, other regulations in the field of local self-government system, an immediate form of uh, local self-government and carried out culture, sports, social and child protection, cooperation with non-governmental organization, the territorial organization of Montenegro, gender equality, education, employee relations, youth, families in the part, conclusion of marriage, birth registers, certification of transcripts, signatures, and so on. The Secretariat of, uh, for Finance, managed by Driton Djokaj, uh, where administrative tasks related to the financing of local self-government, the budget, wages in the public sector, local pub public revenues, temporary financing and carried out, <coughs> salaries of local officials and employees of the municipality, local public revenues, taxes, resident tax, local administrative fees, communal tax, members' contribution, etc. The Secretariat of Urban Planning, which is managed by Leka Ivezai, where administrative tasks related to space planning and construction of building and in other areas affecting the performance of the body's function are carried out. Fees for communal equipment of the construction land paid by the owner of the illegal building, fees for communal equipment, until the adoption of the general regulation plan, annual fee for the use of space, etc. The Secretariat for Agriculture and Rural Development, headed by Ismeta Djoka, carries out agricultural activities in environmental protection, strategic impact assessment, air protection, natural, prote natural protection, waste management, protection against noise in the environment, energy efficiency, protection of the population from infection disease, and so on. The property secretariat, headed by Elvisa Regimatovic, 
and replaced by uh, her deputy, Agim Sinishtai, is not here, uh, performs administration tasks related to monitoring and implementation of laws and regulations adopted on the basic of laws in the area of construction, construction land, state property, state survey, and real estate cadastrate obligations, property legal relations, and other areas related to the performance of the functioning of the authorities. The Secretariat of Economic Development, headed by Shevko Kurpejovic, performs active administrative tasks related to rela uh, regional and development, business zone, control of state aid, communal activities, traffic and roads, housing and maintenance of residential building, tourism, crafts, shops, consumer protection, part-time works, and so on. So the municipality of Tuzi has a professional services, uh, and there are office of the president of the municipality and the office of the main administrator. The office of the president of the municipality carries out professional and other tasks and within the framework of his office, he has the office of the president headed by the chief of cabinet, that is me, the office of the cooperation with the diaspora headed by Mark Luzjonai, Mark, <laughs> the office of the international cooperation headed by Amra Pepic, she's not here right now, and the office for public procurement headed by Daniela Djeljaj. The office of the chief administrator, headed by chief administrator Robert Samai, performs professional and other tasks related to the tasks of the second level body in administrative matters under the authority of the body and special services, supervising the work of local government bodies and many, many other works. Then we have a special service, which is the service of communal police and communal inspection headed by Chief Recep Chunmulyay, which performs tasks related to inspection supervision. You meet Recep last night. The municipality of Tuzi performs activities within the competence through local government, bodies, institutions, companies, and public services of which it is the founder. Regard to that, the first company formed by the municipality of Tuzi is a limited liability company communal, called Comunale Tuzi, and it's managed by Nicola Tsamai, who at the time at that Rochester Hills became sister city with the Tuzi, was the president of the assembly, the chairman, and who together with uh, the then mayor of municipality, Smail Chunmulya, signed the twinning of the two municipalities with you. This company managed by Nicola, performs communal uh, activities, municipal waste management, arrangement and maintenance of public, public areas, management of public lightning, management and maintenance of public cemeteries, management and maintenance of public parking spaces, management and man maintenance of public toilets, etc. We will have the opportunity to get to know uh, with this company in more detail today during our visit there. Furthermore, at the end of last year, the municipality of Tuz formed two companies, um, limited liability companies, marketplace managed by Rujdi Luka, which builds, maintains, and manages market facilities, maintains overall hygiene in the market area and all of its facilities owned by the municipality of Tuz. Preparation and implementation programs in the area of investments, investing in the construction of facilities by joint investment in other investors, renting real estates and managing those real estates, etc. Then the LLC, Water Supply and Severage Tuzi, which is managed by Admir Burat, provides conditions for long-term and stable business and continuous water supply, orderly removal and treatment of wastewater, while ensuring that the goals of the company are aligned with the needs and expectations of users, etc. The municipality of Tuzi this year has also taken over the management of the Cultural Information Center, Malsia, whose director is Vasel Berishai, 
who deal with organizing and improving programs in the field of cultural and artistic creativity, preparing programs, fast festivals and events with music, folklore, drama, art, education, film, literally and other content. When we visit the Cultural Information Center, we will have the opportunity to learn more about their work and functioning. The Municipality of Tours has, also has a tourist organization headed by Leonora de Divanovic, who deal with the improvement and promotion of the original values of the areas of the municipality for which it was founded, creating conditions for activity, uh, activating tourist resources on the territory of the municipality, encouraging coordinating and organizing cultural, artistic, entertainment, economic, sports, and other manifestations, which contribute to enriching the tourist offers and many, many more works. The municipality of Tours has taken over the management of two sports clubs, the football club Dechic, which with director Paul Dreshaj, and the basketball club Dechic with director Enes Turkovic. We will have the opportunity to visit them uh, tomorrow and learn more about their work. Uh, finally, I would like to ask the president, the chairman, to hand over the mayor the monograph of the Maestro Jokai, our well-known painter award renowned, with which our municipality begins its publishing activity, which we hope will flourish in the coming years. Thank you for that um, <clears throat> that introduction and, and that explanation, and um, of course a special uh, fondness in my heart for both uh, Drita and Nikolai, who have been uh, a part of this from the very beginning. Uh, but but since you're all um, municipal employees and leaders, um, and I'm assuming that our media here is friendly, I thought maybe I would share a little bit about um, uh, some municipality things that might be of interest to you, if that's okay if we have a minute. Um, the, the city of Rochester Hills is set up, it sounds like much like uh, Tuzi in different departments with, with different leaders, with different responsibilities. Um, our city is about 80,000 people um, and the 80,000 people are um, wildly uh, diverse. We have the third largest Asian population in the state of Michigan. Um, of course, we always, when I talk about our diversity, say we have the largest um, Albanian Catholic Church outside of Albania uh, in St. Paul's, which of course contributes to the vibrancy of our community. We have a highly educated population, about 60, a little over 60% of our adult population has at least a master, uh, excuse me, a bachelor's degree, so a very highly educated uh, community. Um, and across the recognition of the United States, uh, Rochester Hills does very well. Uh, we've been named a top 10 place to live uh, in the United States by Money Magazine and by CNN. In Michigan, we are the safest city in Michigan for the sixth consecutive year, according to the FBI. Uh, we are a top 2% city for financial stability. Uh, and the list goes on and on. And it certainly isn't because of the mayor, the mayor, myself, my only uh, uh, probably uh, uh, role in this is to hire and find really good people, which it sounds like uh, your leadership team has done here. Uh, our city has a budget of about 160 to 170 million dollars a year. Um, and with that we hire and, and, and have uh, uh, employees anywhere from 400 to 800, depending on the time of the year. In the summer we have uh, a lot more. Uh, we have our largest department, which is our Department of Public Works, uh, which uh, uh, clears the streets of snow in the winter and, and, and fixes the roads in the summer and maintains all of our infrastructure. Uh, they have a 100,000 square foot facility where all their vehicles are kept inside uh, so that when, a, when, when the weather is inclement, they can uh, go at it right away. One of the things that I'm very proud of is that we're a very innovative community. We try to always use technology uh, to solve problems. And so you might find it interesting that our snow plow trucks use lasers uh, to plow the snow uh, and to find the edges of roads, one of the only communities to, to do that. And if you're at home, you can log in on your phone and see where all the 
snow plow trucks are and track them as they clean the community when it, when it happens. Um, our building and ordinance enforcement uh, team uh, is making sure all of our buildings are built up to code. Uh, one of the unique things we do um, in our building department is we share employees with other communities because we have the same code in my city and the cities next to mine. And so we came up with an agreement to, to share employees so we wouldn't have to hire new employees as much or lay off new employees if we ever had to do that. We would share across a wider <clears throat> network which helped us in, in many ways maintain stability in our workforce. Our parks department is exceptional. We just built the number one playground uh, in the state of Michigan last year. Uh, last year in Rochester Hills Parks, we welcomed 1.2 million visitors. Um, we outdrew our baseball team. We outdrew the Detroit Tigers. We had more people come to our parks than the Tigers had come to see them play uh, with over 1.2 million. Um, our police department is, uh, because we're a safe city, um, our police department is a, a place where a lot of folks want to be. Um, we work very hard to maintain that with both proactive enforcement um, and reactive enforcement, obviously. Um, our department is probably small in numbers, but because, again, because of technology and because of our shared services, we share a helicopter with a neighboring community. We share a dog team with a neighboring community. We share a, a dive team with a neighboring community. And so not all of those resources are borne by the city of Rochester Hills. Uh, we have a human resources department that maintains um, our team. One of the things I did a few years ago was recognize the most valuable resource we have as a city are our people. Uh, they're the folks that meet our residents' needs. They're the folks that are the face of who we are. <clears throat> and so when people say, who's your competition, Mayor? Um, I don't say neighboring communities. I say our competition in customer service is Amazon, it's Nordstrom, uh, it's places that do customer service really well. And that's who we strive to be like. Disney, Nordstrom, um, Amazon, places where you know Apple, you get good service uh, if you go. Um, we have a strategy to pay all of our employees 10% more than the average of the communities around us. So if a job opens up in my city, most of the other communities want to work in Rochester Hills because we pay more. Our average employee has been with the city for 13 years and our average salary is about 75,000 US dollars a year. So we pay well, but we get the best. And when you get the best, you can be creative and innovative in how you deploy services. <clears throat> we have a clerk's department that manages our elections. Uh, we have a, an MIS or IT team that manages all of our technical communications. And I would invite you later on today to go to the city's website, rochesterhills.org, and with one click, everything in our entire website uh, turns into Albanian. <laughs> uh, we have the entire language on our, on our website so that all our Albanian visitors and guests and residents can read everything from how to get a permit, to how to pay your taxes, to how to read your water bill, completely in, um, in Albanian, which is a really nice feature uh, and will allow you to explore everything on our website um, in your own native language, which makes it, of course, a lot easier. We have a wonderful fire department. We have a, a, a wonderful planning and economic development team. Uh, we have um, about 1,600 businesses that call Rochester Hills home. And so every year I travel with our team to France or to Germany, and ne next year we're going to Japan to build and bring business relationships back home. Uh, Rochester Hills is the number one manufacturer of robots, not just in Michigan, not just in the United States, but in our continent, we are the number one maker of robots in all of North America, uh, which tells you a little bit about the kind of people that live in our community. So when I heard Drita talking about the way you're set up, um, I, I hope that uh, it reminded me of all of my directors that would be sitting where you are, very proud of the departments they lead, always working to try to find better ways to deliver services, always having residents that demand a little bit more and a little bit quicker, um, but trying to meet the needs with never quite enough resources, but trying to make the resources go as far as they possibly can in unique and innovative ways. And if we get a chance to talk any more today, um, I'd be happy to share more about some of the partnerships. But I, I have a passion for, for local government, and, and it's what drove me to really be interested uh, in this relationship uh, 12 or 13 years ago when you were looking to really start and form a local government. You, you send a team uh, to Rochester Hills and we 
toured the DPS, uh, the Department of Public Services, I can't use DPS, that's bad, right? The Department of Public Services garage, and you sat with our finance team and learned how to collect taxes and how to evaluate uh, homes and, and how to make sure your structure is set up so that your residents feel like what you're doing is transparent. Uh, and, and all those things are, are really passionate to me. So uh, consider me an extension of your team. If we can ever help, if you wanna be connected with your colleague and talk police chief to police chief or, or planner to planner, uh, just let me know and we'll set that up so that you have an additional resource in the United States of America to be even more successful here. Thank you for giving me a couple extra minutes. I wanted to share those thoughts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 